Predictive analytics is a meeting point between statistical analysis and artificial intelligence. It uses machine learning and statistical modeling to predict the future based on historical data. With the help of predictive analytics, the data from past and present is used to predict future trends and behaviors. This, of course, is especially interesting for sales and marketing as it helps to understand the customer and make purchase recommendations. Let's jump into a use case. In this video, we are going to explain two use cases, individual basket prediction and cross-sell prediction. Okay, individual basket prediction. We want to find out which group of products each customer purchases together and to predict the most likely next basket which the customer is going to purchase. Here's an example. Petra goes to supermarket once a week. There are four baskets from the past four weeks. Week 1, spaghetti, bacon and cheese. Week 2, spaghetti, basil and olive oil. Week 3, spaghetti, bacon, cheese and chips. Week 4, spaghetti, basil and olive oil. Now the question will be, what will Petra buy in the next week? This example case is of course very simple. Petra is shopping weekly and follows quite a regular pattern, so we can predict that she is going to buy the same product as in week 1 and week 3. Based on the shopping history, for example, we will also see that chips in week 3 are casual products, so they wouldn't be included in the basket prediction. But in real situations, basket can be up to 100 plus products. The size of the basket can be elastic and also the shopping frequency can change. Here, Ham's algorithm is also capable of catching these. Now, let's jump into the second case, cross-sell prediction or basket extension, which is based on similar customer segments. As a simplified example, since the supermarket opens their web shop, Petra stays home and purchases her basket from home. Meanwhile, there exist two other customers, John and Laura, who purchases very similar baskets to Petra. They also buy spaghetti, bacon, cheese, and basil, but they buy on top tiramisu. Due to their similarity with Petra's buying pattern, there is a high chance that Petra will like the tiramisu, which both John and Laura buy as well. So our Hams algorithm would propose tiramisu to Petra and put it on her recommended product list. Similarly, Laura and John may like olive oil and we should recommend it to them. This simple example illustrates our cross-sell predictions. We group customers based on their buying behavior and predict then the most probable new product the customer may be interested to buy as well. This can be applied not only to supermarket situations, but any other e-commerce businesses. To summarize, prediction algorithms can be used for various product recommendation situations, even when we only have limited information and transaction data. Basket prediction can be used to improve the customer's convenience or to provide accurate revenue and supply chain forecasts. Cross-sell predictions can create and extend business opportunities and potentially boost revenue. If you want to know more about HEMS predictive analytics modules, please contact us.